Hi, my name is Dawn, and I'm in the seventh grade, and I'm from the Albuquerque School of Excellence. Today, I'm going to be talking about the history of ballet. Ballet is a form of dance that requires self-control, a lot of practice time, and extreme dedication. The art of King Louis Ballet was invented in 1459 by King Louis XIV for a royal wedding. The dancers would do dances representing the foods and the meals. Imagine an apple dance. Ballet became extremely popular when King Louis XIV appeared as a dancer. He then founded the Paris Opera Ballet Theater. King Louis's teacher was a man named Pierre Beauchamp, who became the director of the first ballet school in Paris. Before the 1700s, dancers would wear long, heavy dresses that came down to the floor. One dancer, Marie Anne Coupe, cut her dress so that you could see her ankles. After this, the skirts became shorter and shorter and, and stiffer until they stuck straight out to form the modern tutu. The woman who made point dancing popular was Marie Taglioni in the 1830s. Point shoes are still around today, but they have changed. A Frenchman named Marius Pepita choreographed over 60 ballets, including Swan Lake, The Nutcracker, and Sleeping Beauty. An English choreographer created a ballet called Daphne and Chloe for a ballerina named Margot Fontaine. She partnered with a man named Rudolf Nureyev, and they were a sensation together. Thank you for listening to my story.